channel you guys back at it for another video so um today's video is a little different because it is kind of like a hodgepodge of a couple of video ideas that i had that really didn't like they weren't very long of <laughs> video ideas so it's kind of like i guess a day in the life but a little a little different than that so basically i have two hauls and i have two uh organization ones that i worked on sorry i'm distracted there um so <laughs> Um, so we'll go ahead and get into that and I'll go ahead and show you I went to Goodwill first my friends and I had had just had a get-together and um, I noticed that for this we we're gonna do our chartreuse board I might be saying that wrong sorry um, but so we didn't have well I didn't personally have like a big tray that was kind of like nice to put everything on um, all of my stuff was like, either seasonal or it just didn't make any sense with like what we were doing or like the size wise so I went to Goodwill because I have been trying for the most part to not buy new stuff all the time so I went there and then I found like a really nice platter there so I'll show you that in just a moment and then also um, the, some of the wine glasses that we have I got at the Dollar Tree originally but the thing is they break so easily they're really thin glass so like even just like a casual bump they're broken and shattered into pieces. So I've been kind of like frustrated about that and I've been trying to like slowly transition into like thicker, more hardy glasses um, just because I feel like that would be more sustainable long term. So um, in the past I've gotten two kind of like more goblet wine glasses at Goodwill in the past so I just decided to look today and to see what they had and then I found these larger ones that were like kind of a fun design and they're very thick and sturdy so I got three of those so now I have five new glasses total new as it was so the Dollar Tree is like a dollar obviously plus what like eight cents for tax um and then these ones were like maybe a dollar 99 starting but they're really a lot more sturdy so i felt like it was worth the investment in that and then when i was at the dollar tree i went there actually looking for some organizational things because i wanted to organize my fridge and my pantry and my pantry has had so many different ideas like to organize it and they've been kind of flops like between having drawers that you pull out and you have snacks and drawers and like just di bins and like all kinds of different things and it's just never worked so i had to try to find another system that was i could use and that would be actually that i do have um some new like uh, spatulas and stuff like that and that's just because they were really cute and it kind of sold me because they had like the marble ends and I was like sold love it gotta get it um plus it's always nice to have a little bit of extra of those because I feel like those when you're cooking get dirty pretty quick um and you know or if they're in the wash or something like that then you have a backup so I feel like they were re responsibly uh you know worthwhile and then the other one um the organizing bins I got those for the fridge primarily because I was thinking I could put like fruits and vegetables in there and I'll show you in a moment how I did that um, and then also some just containers with tops and I did that so that maybe if I have something I'm just trying to store like vertically or like just make things a little bit more sorted through in the fridge so we'll see the before and after in just a moment but um, later on the pantry end I did not get a ton of organizers at the Dollar Tree and I opted to go through after I kind of went there and I went and got some stuff that I know I didn't have I went through my closet opens <laughs> and looked through everything I had and was like I'm just gonna pull out all these different ones whether they match or not whatever they look like and I will work with this and try to organize it and I think I pretty did a pretty good job of just using like a hodgepodge of different types of shapes and size of bins to make things work so so uh, we will go into that now and then I'll go ahead and show you what I did on that but again kind of a random video but that's just literally because I was like I can't just post like the tiniest haul in human possible like human history it's the smallest haul for two stores and then <laughs> anyway just we're gonna get into it we're gonna get into it right now okay and I'll see you back in a moment so here you guys can see this is the before of our fridge it is just 
pretty unorganized in general. It's kind of like um, some leftovers just thrown around, stuff like that. And a lot of vegetables that are just kind of in bags and you can't really find them really easily. Um, so I just wanted to go through and then basically resort this and try to make some sort of order um, to be able to see what we have. So here we go. So here is the after you guys. So uh, basically I bought some containers at the Dollar Tree and I used those to organize the fruits and vegetables. And then the drinks, I just kind of try to keep to one side or the other, putting the meats kind of in the middle, meats and cheeses and stuff. And then uh, here's a before of my pantry. So you can see like there is no rhyme or reason. I tried to use those red bins, but that was not the best organization system for us. Even the cat doesn't even know what's going on in there. So um, we bas I basically just took everything out and then kind of started over again. So uh, you will see the transformation in just a second. Here we go. Um, so basically what I did was put all the cans on top and put them facing toward me. Um, I tried to organize the snacks by like type. So we had a lot of dessert stuff and like kind of junk food because for some reason when the... Uh, uh, coronavirus stuff started. I was just like stock up on junk food. Have no idea why because now it's like I don't really feel like eating it so it's just kind of here but hope you guys enjoyed the video today and that um, you can find some inspiration to organize some maybe areas in your house that are really bugging you and just to get that done it feels so great.